the schedule. I kind of feel like Carl set up the fail there after they only hired Gunn. But, uh, here we go. I'm going to be brief, less than five minutes. Again, uh, thank you all for coming. It's uh, kind of awe-inspiring to look out and see literally uh, tens of people. Uh, <laughs> but no, a general disclaimer, I was not the first choice. It was supposed to be uh, Brandon giving this speech. Brandon uh, Benedict Arnold Corbett. And, uh, yeah. Uh, I'm not sure exactly what he did to be uh, a traitor. Say a wedding? wedding. Yeah, wedding. So something like that. You, you tell that to this little guy. <laughs> All right. Um, another kind of making excuses here. Uh, you can probably tell I'm a little under the weather today, which you probably couldn't tell. But my uh, dog's grandfather was just hospitalized. They're, uh, yeah, they're thinking it may be heartworms. So that's, that's no good. Um, I, I do want to bring a little bit of levity to the situation. As, as he, he discussed, the film was it was quite frightening. Uh, RB, I'm pretty sure, owns some stock in Fruit of Loom and Haynes or something. Because, uh, yeah, he'll be he'll give me a business a little bit later. But um, I can carry on with some more silliness. But before Brandon did leave, he uh, left me with this article that he was going to speak on. So I'll, I'll talk on that a little bit. Uh, Ten things that every American should know about the Federal Reserve. Uh, luckily, in the honey pot. And we have some cheat sheets here. I don't know if they are in invisible ink. Well, okay. Flip. All right. Expert bitch the for his. Is this Norwegian? Okay. <laughs> Okay, 10 things that every American should know about the Federal Reserve. The Federal Reserve is a privately owned banking cartel. Uh, the Federal Reserve System is a perpetual debt machine. Um, click to start. The film talked about it some. Again, I'm, I'm pretty sure that they're never going to ask me to do this again, and that's just as well. But, uh, the Fed has destroyed more than 96% of the value of the dollar since its institution in 1913. The Fed can uh, bail out whoever it wants with no accountability. The Federal Reserve is paying banks not to lend money. Apparently they send it into the Fed uh, to increase their reserves and they give them insurance, or excuse me, uh, uh, there you go, interest on that. Uh, the Federal Reserve creates artificial economic bubbles that are extremely damaging. The Federal Reserve is dominated by the big uh, Wall Street banks. It's not an accident that we saw the personal income tax and the Federal Reserve system both come into existence in 1913. They're linked. The article goes into this as the business insider, and uh, I'll pass it around. I'll think Brandon would mind that uh, afterwards. Uh, the reason I'm kind of rushing through this is I'm quite certain everyone out there knows more about this than I do. So, uh, current Federal Reserve Chair. Ben Bernanke has a nightmarish track record of incompetence. Uh, the Federal Reserve has been has become way too powerful. And uh, with my own, just looking on uh, YouTube, Aaron Russo's Freedom of Fascism, good film, he goes over some of this stuff. And, uh, Bill Stills, a different take than Ron Paul, with the, uh, he supports a fiat money system, but uh, with uh, no fractional reserves. Uh, the Money Masters, uh, Secret of Oz, several good films with him. Uh, but the whole Money is Debt series is, is interesting, worth looking into. And um, I'm a sucker for Alex Jones for any of this stuff, so uh, infowars.com. Uh, 